Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to do a race setup for F1 2022 for Spain. So this is set up for about 25% race, that's what I usually race, so that's what I usually set my cars up for. You don't really want to use it in a hot lap or in time trial because it doesn't really work in there. It's much more for when you are racing. You can use it in career mode, you can use it online or when you're racing your friends. But let's get straight into it, shall we? So fuel load, ignore that. Aerodynamics, so the front wing error is 29, the rear wing error is 26. I'm not going to tell you exactly why I've done what I've done. We're just going to skip through it really quickly because that's what you want to know. You just want to know the information, don't you? So we just go to transmission. On throttle is 68 and off throttle is 54%. And then if we go into suspension, front camber is 2.6 degrees. Rear camber is 1.3 degrees minus on both. Front toe and rear toe, well, front toe is 0 0.06 degrees and rear toe is 0 0.02, which is completely at the bottom. Suspension, front suspension is 7, rear suspension is 1, anti-roll bar for the front is 8, rear anti-roll bar is 1, front ride height is 5, and rear ride height is 4. And then in the brakes, we're going to use the same as what we always use, brake pressure 100, front brake bias and 50. If we're going to tyres, we're just going to go front and left are 23.3 psi, and then the rear tyres are 22.3 psi. So that is my race setup, and that is what I will use in Spain what i found that works so far i'll use that for 25 percent so if you like that give me a like and a subscribe and check out my other videos